Sean McLean taking a four-round venture back into the heavyweight division. That's where Sean started out, but his return has been as a cruiserweight. He holds the IBC Cruiserweight World Championship. And right now you see Sean McLean coming out to meet heavyweight Jean Claude Lair. We're just underway now. Round one scheduled for four. Fight coming to you from Phoenix, Arizona. Sam Sapiro in ringside for the eight-pound boxing hour following the career of Irish Sean McLean out of Rio Rancho, New Mexico. And you can see right off the bat that Tom Claude is every bit as big as Sean McLean, maybe the, well, actually quite a bit the bigger man. And uh, Irish Sean McLean, though, the cruiserweight that carries heavyweight punch and power. And there you see McLean just pushing Jean Claude Lair off of him back into the ropes. He'll get a warning now from the referee. Jean-Claude Lair, who's a popular fighter here in Phoenix. Some of the people at ringside telling me that they think he could, could be something. I asked them about his record, 4-2. And, and they said yes, but also a win by knockout. And he's been fighting bigger anyway. And he's, of course, the same as in the two losses. So they say that they're very confident that he'll be able to defeat Sean McClain. But right now you see Sean McClain ripping shots on Jean-Claude Lair. McLean, the man who's been searching for Thomas Hearns, had the contract signed and Tommy Hearns decided that he would not take the challenge of Sean McLean, Irish Sean, scaring away Thomas Hearns for a hit and disappointing a lot of the fans by backing away from Sean McLean. Pretty good opening round for Jean Claude Lair. He's landed a lot of solid shots. Sean McLean has landed some good punches, but Lair has really. And now Sean McLean going to work. Looked like he kind of stunned Lair, but Lair tries to fight his way back. This is the way the fight's been going. Sean, oh, a good right back for Sean McLean now. That's a bell. So Lair was taking control of the round, but right at the end there, a big flurry by Sean McLean, and that was a close round. 
So Sean McLean starting to open up there at the end of the first round. Jean Claude Lair getting a little bit confident. And we're heading into round two here from Phoenix, Arizona. You're watching the eight count boxing hour on Community Cable Channel 27 in Albuquerque. Dan Cisneros at ringside bringing you the action. And we had a good opening first round here in this heavyweight matchup. Sean McLean moving up to the heavyweights. Round two underway now. Irish Sean McLean in the blue trunks, Jean-Claude Laire in the black trunks with the blue with the gold waistband. Again, you see Laire working behind that jab. He keeps throwing that jab out there, trying to keep Sean McLean away. He tasted some of the power of Sean McLean at the end of that first round, but Sean McLean also taking some hard punches from Jean-Claude Laire. Laire, the bigger man, he's the true heavyweight. But Sean McLean looking to stay busy here, taking this fight. Scheduled for four rounds in the heavyweight division. Again, Jean-Claude Laire working with both hands now. And shots again to the head of, of Sean McLean. And there's a right hand from McLean. And he has Laire hurt again now. Sean McLean working with both hands. Takes a shot from the left hand of Jean-Claude Laire. McLean going right back to work. Oh, my goodness. Sean McLean just ripping shots again, again. Left hand now. Lair is out on his feet. The referee jumps in now, and Jean Claude Lair is flopping all over the ring. He's had enough. It's all over. Sean McLean out of nowhere. Jean Claude Lair decided to go into a shootout, a slugfest with Sean McLean, and that was a big mistake. Sean McLean unleashing that overwhelming power. And Jean Claude Lair literally out on his feet, flopping around, saved by the referee. And I'm not sure he still knows where he is.